Hi, I'm Wade from Thoroughbred Diesel, and today we're going to be showing you Thoroughbred Diesel's VP44 breakout box. All right, folks, we finally got our own VP44 breakout box here at Thoroughbred Diesel. And this has everything that we wanted on our wish list of what a breakout box should be um, that we've come up with here. So we're going to show that to you here today. So we first off, we really just wanted to get a much more affordable uh, breakout box out there into the marketplace. And we also wanted to get a uh, and uh, we, we wanted to get a device that gave you guys the ability to test the VP44 independent of the ECM safely. And the reason why I say that is on the, uh, we had a lot of our customers over the years that were applying, that were applying power to the PSG to try to run independently of the ECM. And while that will work, it's still dangerous because you can cross the ends of the of the uh, power wires and get a, an arc and that can fry up your PSG. So we wanted to have a safe device, an affordable device that is gonna help you guys with your diagnosis. So uh, I just wanna talk a little bit about what a breakout box actually is. Now, what this does is this will allow you to run the VP44 equipped vehicle independent of the ECM. So 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 long as you have proper lift pump pressure, your lift, your lift pump is running, uh, you can apply uh, this breakout box and the truck will start and run again, independent of the ECM. So if you've got an ECM failure, or maybe you're trying to figure out if maybe your crank position sensor is a problem for a no start, um, this would isolate that and, and, and so forth. So that's that's what a breakout box does. And again, this has all of the features on our wish list of what a breakout box should be. Uh, we use the genuine OEM style PSG uh, harness and clip at the PSG. This works just like your stock harness does, slides right on the PSG. As you push it forward, it kind of starts to, to close itself and then it clamps and locks on. And again, we, this also keeps the wires isolated so you're not gonna have any arcing inside of that. So as you're running the truck, if you wanna shut the truck off, you just hit the red button right here and the truck will shut down. Uh, and, and that just get that so you don't have to go back in the cab. You can shut it off right from the right from the VP44. And then our power wires, the two things that we wanted with our power wire, our power wires, we wanted to make sure that they were well insulated so we can isolate them from arcing on this as well. And then we wanted to leave the wires separated. So if you want to catch your ground at a chassis, uh, a chassis point or something like that, you don't have to necessarily go back to the to the battery. You can, but you don't have to. So uh, very well insulated, very very nice uh, alligator clips that we've got here. So yeah, again, guys, just another uh, another more affordable uh, option for you out there in the market for a breakout box. You guys that are doing a lot of VP44s in the shop, if you've been applying power, um, you know, a certain way for a number of years, this gives you an alternative to to add another diagnostic tool uh, to your arsenal. So. If you've got a question about VP44s, breakout boxes, or anything, just give us a call. And thank you for watching.